<coughs> How's it going guys? <laughs> How's this? How, how is everyone? Hope everyone is good. I haven't been uh, posting, <laughs> uploading any videos because I have been quite the busy man or I'm just lazy. Yeah, maybe I'm just lazy. I haven't been on my bike uh, for, for about two months. Uh, this is my second day on my bike. So, uh, what did I do? I went and did a Euro trip for a month. And I also went to New York for about two weeks or less than two weeks. And it was amazing. <laughs> Very amazing, if you ask me. I cannot explain to you how it feels to travel you just gotta go out and do it yourself because A you gain experience in life B you start to enjoy the little things like when I was there um, I went to uh, France uh, Lyon, uh, Geneva uh, I also went to Venice I went to Finland as well and then after that I went to uh, New York for about, you know, like I said, two weeks or less than two weeks, and it was amazing. You know, it's I can't explain to you guys how it feels. Like a lot of people would say, "Oh, how was your trip?" I, I all I could say is, just, um, "It's amazing," and uh, that's all. You know, it is one of those things where you just gotta go out and do it yourself. And I am lucky, the fact that I have friends who were staying uh, around those sp specific areas that I traveled to. So I was pretty much, you know, crash at their price. Didn't, uh, didn't really spend on anything on like accommodation or whatever, you know, like I just spent food. And uh, I don't know, I'm not your typical traveler because uh, I don't know, I'm not really a shopaholic, I only buy stuff from eBay, like I said. <laughs> and uh, everything else is just cheap, you know. Um, I think for me, uh, the reason why I enjoyed it so much is the fact that I don't have any high expectations of these places, you know. I just go there to visit friends and then they just like take me around and I'm like, oh my god, this is like the best thing ever. If they weren't there, I wouldn't have gone, in my opinion anyway. So. Uh, Quite hesitant at first, you know, like I was deciding to like either to save up for a new bike or um, your road trip and uh, it was the best decision of my life, even though I hated planes, but once you get there, you're like, oh my god, it's the best thing. Um, highlights, uh, I'm not sure about highlights because the only reason that I went to these places is the I wanted to eat the food and run because for me running is like one of those things where uh, you get to feel the country <laughs> so I pretty much ran everywhere I haven't been here before actually I have but I can't remember when I was here I think I was here on a, on a train I took the train instead Am I on the right way? Williams boat ramp. Um, hmm. I have no idea. Well, I guess I am at the sea already, so. <laughs> Can't really complain though. The sea water. But yeah, if you wanna travel, just travel small first. Like places like here. You know? You gotta at least start somewhere. And 
and uh, yeah, gotta start somewhere. I wonder how much these houses cost. I'm quite certain they'll probably reach the millions. Oh, look at it. That's the city of Melbourne right there. It's right over there. City of Melbourne. <laughs> I'm just cruising along. Wow. Well, this is, uh, I think, Williamstown Beach, I think. People fishing. Is that a fishing rod? I don't know. Man, this is why you should come to Melbourne. Because places like these, you just don't discover it until the... I don't know. It's, uh, it's amazing, you know, like the fact that I get to see this on a motorbike. I'm just saying. <coughs> there are lots of... Uh, Find a parking spot for the baby. So it's over. Scuba diving, eh? This is uh, kind of breathtaking. <laughs> I mean,
Anyway. <laughs> I think I'll go uh, to the bike shop now. I think I need new pants. I mean, proper pants. Maybe leather pants? <laughs>